everybody welcome back to another vlog um, today I'm going to be talking about my homemade lamps that I have made for my wife over the last few years and um, we're going to pack up some hamburger and cook some spaghetti so here we go first of all I'm going to talk about the lamps um, this is my most recent lamp um, these cans are from my wedding. They're hanging behind my car. Um, things I like about it is this this, this leather um, wrap going around here that's holding the hook for the cord. And the cord, how old it is. Um, I've got myself a Edison uh, light bulb in there. Um, I'll go ahead and turn it on for you. that one it's not too bright and it's not too dull and this it's this a nice one to go next to your couch so um, it's um, one of my favorites and it's the only um, tall one I have so I'm gonna unplug this so we can have some better lighting so I can show you the other ones All right, so here we go. Um, I'll start with this one here since this is the first one I've made. It comes with the um, on and off switch right here. Um, you can plug your phone in to charge it at nighttime. This light can this go right next to your bed and it's a perfect reading light. Um, it swivels. It's, it's just an overall pretty cool light. I'll turn it on for you. That also has the Edison bulb. Um, I'll turn it off so I can show you the other one. Um, but yeah, I mean, they're kind of pricey to make, but they're awfully fun. <laughs> so I definitely recommend it if you're looking for a hobby. So that's the first one I bought my wife, or I made for my wife for Christmas. Um, this one here is this something I made out of uh, old antique light. Um, it, I, the only original parts are um, the orange parts. <laughs> um, I also did the same thing with the switch and the electrical outlets to plug your phone in. I'll go ahead and turn it on for you. That also has the Edison bulb and when it's real dark out, you can see it coming through the holes at top and stuff. Um, so that's a pretty cool one. It's a little bit more modern. I'll go ahead and shut it off so i show, show you the next one. Alright, so this is the most recent lamp I've built. Um, I gave this to my wife um, this Chris, last Christmas. Um, I started it with a bull horn that I got from Texas and uh, sanded it down and polyurethaned it. And I had to cut a hole in here, about right here, um, to get the pipe to go through it and this so I can ma make it. <laughs> um, this one also swivels, you can make it however you want. Um, this is an old piece of a reclaimed fence and I got myself a horseshoe in here um, yeah so it's this pretty cool coffee table lamp I'll go ahead and turn it on for you so yeah it's it's a pretty cool lamp that's out of the ordinary uh, Western style so um, those are my lamps and um, I also made this wine glass holder right here um, out of an old antique rake. Um, it has my wife's flowers uh, dangles on there. Um, uh, so yeah, um, those are my lamps. Um, I'm in the middle of starting my own uh, uh, 
business selling these. Um, I'm in the middle of getting my website put up. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. I'll be putting my website under one of my next videos. Um, and um, there you have it. Also, one thing I was going to mention um, about my vlogs, I mentioned the last two times that I was going to try to do daily vlogs, but I found out it's kind of hard to do. So I'm going to go with two times a week at the moment. It's going to be Wednesday and Sunday, about 12 o'clock each day. Um, that way I can kind of practice a little bit better, have better quality, and um, just really think out my vlogs before I put them up. Um, so that's the end of this part. Next, we're going to be packing up hamburger, so stay tuned. Hi hey everybody, time to start packing up the hamburger. Catch you in a minute. I finally got all the hamburger packed up here. Um, this is going to be for Monday. This is going to be for Tuesday. That's going to be for Wednesday. So we're having hamburgers three days in a row. Two hamburgers each. This is going to be Thursday right here. Uh, we'll make beef stroganoff. This is going to be Friday here. This will be tacos. This will be um, Saturday and Sunday. This is going to be hot dish. It's kind of like goulash. So we're eating real healthy around here. And they're all going to be frozen meals. So <laughs> there you go. Does it make a lot of sense? No. Welcome back, everybody. Um, now it's time to make some spaghetti. Um, here's the ingredients. I'm going to whip it all together for you. And then we'll be done. Catch you in a little bit. Welcome back, everybody. I'm sorry I kind of fibbed. I told you we were going to have spaghetti, and this is what we ended up with. So, um, with that being said, we're going to have spaghetti night some other time. <laughs> Don't you just love it? All right. Well, everybody have a um, good day and night. Depends on when you're watching it. Um, just don't forget to subscribe and click the thumbs up and notification bell and this leave a good comment or comment on what you'd like to see. Um, and God bless.